Welcome back, Em and friends. Today's topic is the Dublin Cube. Our game site has just recently introduced the Cube, considering how old the game of backgammon is and that the use of the Cube began sometime during the 1920s. You might also say that the world has only just recently introduced the Dublin Cube. So, for our players new to Dublin, how do we use this mysterious Cube? Well, Expert use comes with experience, and future videos will offer some quick insights. But first, here are the rules. The cube begins in the middle, on one, even though there's usually no one on a real cube. On our side, the cube reads 64. It's in the middle because both players, on their turn, before they roll, are allowed to raise the stakes of the game by turning the cube to two. That's doubling. The doubled opponent can then either pass the double and lose one point, in which case the game ends, or if he thinks his chances are good enough, he can take the double and is now playing for two points, or twice the original stakes. Once a player has accepted the cube, that player is now said to own the cube, and that means that he is the only player that can further raise the stakes of the game by doubling again, and that's called redoubling which is where we'll pick up on our next Cube Talk. Ciao!